Hello and welcome back to Railway Empire 2. We're sat in Rock Springs. We are not founded yet and we are not playing the game. So I should do that because I just noticed we are broke. I'm so used to us starting with money in the last few episodes. But we have spent a lot, haven't we? And we've got a few trains underway. One of them we rode down here and uh, it was not me laying on the whistle that was the ai i don't know what was going on if you didn't watch it go back and uh, and watch the end of the previous video and you'll see what i mean so today rock springs needs to be founded and there's our trains uh what do we have going down there so two logging trains our meat should be on the way somewhere oh we've got another another issue with triangles that's all i'm going to call them I thought I put them on this triangle. I did not. We need to place a supply tower on the triangle to remove the triangle. There we go. Beautiful. You can fill up for whatever reason. Is that our meat train? It is not. In fact, I don't know what you are. You are... Yeah, you are heading for the sugar and the grain. Are you our meat train? Rock Springs. There we go. All the meat they require is on the way. We should, yeah, we've got to find some grain and we've got to make sure we've got enough to send two trains. So we've got some there. That's nice. We do have plenty over at Hobbs Farmstead as well, near North Platte. But there's our first trains. We're going to sell them as soon as they, they go. Well, that one we can let go. Should we just let it go? That'll be fine, won't it? It'll fill up with another, or it should do, fill up with another eight car loads of logs but we can get rid of the one behind it we're going to save up enough money because we need to buy us a tailors once we've founded the city just one more delivery right yes one more delivery you should have read it when you had it open originally right evans train station to rock springs we'll need two grain trains won't we Freight only baldwin 10 wheeler and here we go wait until eight and then we'll duplicate you as well we'll get another one running in hopefully we have enough grain left i did see a grain train leaving he hasn't taken a full load Ooh, we've only got nine in there this might have been a mistake well there's one train load we do have trains queued up as well and of course we've got uh walter who's also taking grain from this this grain farm so are we going to have enough in there well we've got six at the moment maybe we're not uh, doing this for any sort of task really i mean it is part of denver's task but they are growing at 91.7 percent at the moment so not urgent if we can grab these last couple of uh, car loads of grain that'll be great what are you making you're making 2.8 a week there we go we just took another one didn't we are you all going on to our rock springs train you are how's our wood doing oh well we've got to wait for our there it is yeah i think that's it we've got to wait for our meat train to get there regardless is this the last of the logs it is the last of the logs what is this uh, it made eleven thousand just founding rock springs that's kind of lovely isn't it gentlemen's club we're not bidding we can't afford it anyway okay let's uh delete you our trains have made it or some of them at the very least and we can sell these once they're done there we go get rid of you that should be our meat how many we got yep and then our grain train i don't know where you are you're up there somewhere there you are right final train and we get rock springs up and running do we want to make grand junction maybe maybe it wouldn't be too terrible would it right let's get rid of you don't need you in there at the moment what we would like to do though is get us where are you yes a new production it is the weaving mills where do we want you probably this side and we'll get you hooked in and deliver you some wool oh, this is at zero i don't know how much it will cost us there we go it's not too bad is it why not we're going to make money from it even at level one 
Good, I got. I doubt that this investment was worth it. Again, little do you know, I have a weaving mill as well, so it's absolutely worth it. Maybe take us a while to uh, recoup our... Should we call it an investment? Yeah, why not? It is kind of an investment. It's a bit rough on the old terrain, but we can head all the way down here. In fact, that might send us in at exactly the right level. So it might be lovely terrain after all that. It, in fact, it's beautiful, isn't it? 40 miles an hour. Don't mind it for this little short journey. Little short journey. And we can now set up some services running out of here. Mixed services, perhaps. Uh, definitely mixed service heading into Denver, right? Because they're going to definitely want our our cloth once we start making it, our wool cloth. And do we want to bother? Oh, do you know what? Why not? Why not? We can definitely afford it, can't we? Let's get a train line set up. Freight only. Wait until four is what we're going with there. And we'll get you up and running. Are you going to start taking some wool from our, our wool farm, our sheep farm, into our weaving mills in Rock Springs? Yes, you are. Right, and I guess we'll start our train from Denver. It does have to go through Cheyenne at the moment, but we've got it set up quite nicely. We might be able to scoot through there. We have to get on the inside platform, which is a little unfortunate. We might be able to rejiggle that, perhaps, if it gets too troublesome. But there we go, an automatic train. This will be the Inyo. And you should be good to go, right? That's all we need for that one at the moment. We'll see what it takes anyway. It's actually getting quite busy, isn't it, over in uh, Denver? We might need to extend their capacity as well. Expand their capacity. Do we have our train? There we go. It's quite orange, isn't he? I never realised. Well, we can colour it whatever colour we like, can't we? Are you going to load up? You're going to take some beer, of course, beer. Yeah, is that ours as well? We bought that beer. Brewery, didn't we? Beery? We brought that beery. Yes, we did. Oh, goodness me, that's all they're taking. Rock Springs is like party. Let's do it. We're, we're celebrating uh, us founding ourselves as a city. I mean, we technically did it. Are oh, there... Do you know? I can sit down here and look at these little... Uh, little people walking around. Little AI peeps just milling around as well. It's great. There's a lot going on in the cities. Doesn't have to be, like, perfect, does it? As long as there's some movement going on. Don't care where they're going. Whether they're going to a place or they're just meandering along the cobblestones. It's nice. Nice. Gives it a bit of character. A bit of life. Okay, right. So we've got that train hooked up. Now, I guess... I guess we could stop at Cheyenne. But likelihood is... We're going to be full, or we're going to be carrying loads of stuff to Cheyenne as well, and then it, we won't get anything. Or we won't get as many things from Denver, heading all the way through to Rock Springs. So we'll set up a separate line, heading from, we'll start at Rock Springs into Cheyenne. That should do us, shouldn't it? And this will be, no, not freight only. We want that automatic, which is the Inyo. There we go, confirm that. And at any meet that they start to overproduce in Cheyenne, or we overproduce, it is our, our industry, we can take there, can't we? We'll have to take them more than that. How's Denver doing now? Well, it shouldn't have changed, Grand. We haven't even got there. But uh, we do have a train heading away. There we go. We're taking some mail, some passengers, and our first little bit of uh, cloth down to uh, Cheyenne, believe it or not. It's supposed to be going to Denver, but... Rock Springs should start to grow shortly. We could pay for the settler's bonus, but I still feel like that's a waste of money at the moment. Are you just waiting? Oh, I bet you haven't actually left. You should be leaving now, shouldn't you? How much are you waiting for? You might be waiting for eight. Yeah, we need to change you to four now. There we go. Now you can go. I don't think he's actually left the building. <laughs> no. Uh, his route should stop him over on that platform there. There we go. You can leave. Beautiful. And do you know what? While we're here, let's give you a maintenance building. There's our competitor. 
You're taking two logs, sir. I am taking four. Twice as much profit for us. I don't know whether it actually works out mathematically like that, but uh, close enough. Right, now you can go through. We won't have this issue any longer now that he's doing his first run, as he'll pull on over to here. We don't have a train running to Rock Springs yet, so we'll set that up and wait until four. I'm debating whether to do something different with the train that's currently taken. Do you take it to Cheyenne? Uh, where's our Cheyenne train? Not Rock Springs. Yes, that one, isn't it? Yeah, currently you just go to Cheyenne. We could continue on to Denver. Denver's not getting any logs, is it, at all? I don't think, anyway. Uh, stock in the city. Oh, no, you are. I don't know where you're getting it from. Oh, okay. We'll leave. <laughs> yes, this is great. We'll leave Walter to supply the logs. He's obviously doing it. You do that. We'll take him to Cheyenne. I know you probably want to take him to Cheyenne. Your network's an absolute disaster, though. They tend to have one train that just stops everywhere. Not the best way to do it. Don't copy the AI, whatever you do. This is just trains waiting to be filled. Um, there's just not much demand for it. Again, we could have a third station a third station, a third platform here, so that this isn't a thing. And while he's waiting to get in, that might not be a bad idea. Yeah, providing we've got a, at least a block after the supply tower. This should reset him anyway. There we go. And get rid of that. Yes, we have, in fact, we have two blocks. Look at that, beautiful. So now all three trains that we have running out of here is... Oh, it's only one? Oh, that might be it needs to reset. It should be three, shouldn't it? I mean, I saw three trains in there. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, no need to worry about the X's. It's a shame they show up forever. But it is a reminder that you could do something else with them, but I don't find them to cost us any money, really, doing it with an X. Eventually, they will um, catch up with their deliveries as the cities get bigger. I guess the other thing is, what it, what is causing the X? It's not supply, so it will be demand. We've already met the demand. And yeah, there we go. We're absolutely chock and block on grain. Uh, not so much on corn. Not so much on corn. We don't have a warehouse here. And we're taking it all direct. But we could have a, a way to take it to Omaha, really, couldn't we? Perhaps we do get a warehouse in here. We're, oh, we're going to have to do some shenanigans, though, if we do this. Let's edit that. No, we've got to do the warehouse first. I wouldn't mind popping grain in here. No, not grain, corn. In fact, where are you getting grain from? You get it from Topeka, don't you? Topeka has grain. I'm sure it does. Topeka, do you have grain? Yes, but we're not taking enough. That should be for Omaha. If it isn't, we need to probably address that somehow. We could take it from North Platte instead, thinking about it. Yeah, let's get you in there. I don't know why I added cows. Ignore that. Yeah, let's get you in there. Then we can change the Wichita train to get in there. Not take uh, corn or grain from North Platte because you get your own. And we don't need corn from Wichita either. No. Confirm that. Right, that's tidied it up a little bit. Now Omaha should start asking for a little bit of corn from uh, Adams Farm. Uh, run by the Adams family, no doubt. Do we have any on the way? Not yet. We might do soon. The orders might come through. I'm hoping so. We have a... Well, do you know, we don't even have a mixed train. I set all this up and there's no mixed train. How long has that been like that? For eternity. Well, let's get you set up, shall we? And in fact, we'll run two, because why not? Uh, we'll get two Inyos on there. Beautiful, yeah. And then you can start exchanging some goodies. I'm sure you're going to uh, send quite a few things between each other as well. Dick, stop clicking on the research. It's because of the little star. It makes me want to click on it. In Railway Empire 1, if you haven't played that, when the star's there, it means there is something to spend that star on. It doesn't quite work like that. In Railway Empire 2, it just tells you 
how many stars are there up to a maximum of three i believe right which train is this this is the cheyenne train and uh it'll be nice to see some cloth heading back into denver at some point and again we're definitely going to have to think about widening our platform here aren't we uh what sort of extension could we have here do you know we could just have a restaurant or something for now while i'm pondering and then we'll get a bit more money from our passengers why not right we have trains in there and none waiting should we expand just a an extra platform should do us if we can squeeze it in there we go lovely we've got a little bit more room there now for when all trains appear at once that's all it is really timing isn't it uh, yeah there we go cheyenne trains have gone straight through we have trains over that end we do have uh oh yeah we don't have one there what is this Ooh. oh dear that was awful i'm like ooh, shares and money I, d I didn't read anything else i should have read inheritance we've been given a hundred construction industry stocks there we go construction industry whatever that covers wood would be one wouldn't it and planks surely cement would be another i guess but yes i a little bit distracted there what i'd like to do is give you a uh, repair station or a maintenance depot two stars now do we have two stars we'd like to spend oh yes tunnels wasn't there i believe yes tunnels are a thing reduce the cost of constructing tunnels some of the terrain around Camp Raton is a bit treacherous. And if we can get away with cheaper tunnels, that'd be great. I don't know about Grand Junction yet. Oh, look, he, he went straight through. He went under. We cost him a fortune. Oh, guys, I should have gone down. I messed it up. Well, we don't need that there anymore, do we? Look at him being cheeky. That was actually perfect for him to do that. Dear, oh dear, well, I'll leave you to go up to that area. What did you want anyway? You went all that way to get sugar, which we have here. Are you going to stop in Rock Springs is the question. I mean, it's a bit cheeky, but we could block you from doing that, I guess. Uh, if you didn't know, maximum number of stations in a, in a town is three. So if you do that, the AI cannot build there. But uh, people have told me that that's a little bit metagamey. Gaming the game, as I like to call it. And uh, yeah, so we won't do that. Right, we've got a full train running back. Oh yeah, that was taking the beer, wasn't it? And uh, they're, they're not done. Party's going on for ages there. There's more beer on the way. And Rock Springs, how are you doing with your production? Uh, do we want another building on here? Do you know, shall we go for a market hall? Mix it up a little bit. Uh, these buildings, the market hall and such, will count even if they transfer there or originate there. So when you have like a, a bunch of different ones, you'll end up getting both depending on how many trains they hop across. Kind of focuses on point to point as opposed to multi-stop. Since you will get the benefit from market halls and stuff by changing trains it depends if the ai uh, are more competitive with direct routes but they're not not at this level anyway right what i was going to check yes how are we doing on our production 100 percent on our production absolutely lovely we've got two cloth in there we make how many do we make 1.6 it's one for one that's lovely should we check on our guns over at return pass or camp return uh what is that on the way that should be our passengers right yeah that's the fork we're not express fork we're not express we've got more slowed trains did i never put this back yes i may have forgotten right get you in there there we go now you're happy oh you have one up here it must be the no i'm not sure why you've got no goodies what train is that oh it's this one yeah because we remove that i don't know whether we just want them on here then well it doesn't matter now does it they're separated yeah we've only got one train heading or one line heading on that track and then we've only got one line heading on there not a complete disaster topeka has grown 
yeah, I was supposed to check on the guns, but we need to get this done. Uh, your company has received a blackmail letter. Its author demands 318,000 coins. Sure. But what are we building in Topeka? That is the question. I'm, you know, I'm not sure. Can you remember what I was going to build? What are you building? Ah, yes. We could have... We could have furniture here, couldn't we? Would that be a good one? They're already making paper. We could take their planks and make furniture. We already have clothing over in Kansas City. Yeah, I'm going to go with furniture. That's not too terrible, is it? I don't know which side we want to go. We've got more red this side. And we'll leave a bit of room in case we want to put a station in there. There we go. Furniture underway. That should get a little bit of demand now from Omaha. I am not overly bothered about constructing buildings to make these cities grow faster. We could. Definitely. Uh, maybe Kansas if we should. They've only got an immigration center at the moment. So if we build them a library, perhaps we'll see them grow again. And the same in Omaha. Oh, I don't think Omaha has anything. Oh, it doesn't. There we go. Have a a uh, library. We'll see if Kansas starts growing. Wichita, we currently have a university there. We'll need to supply quite a bit for Wichita to grow. They're at 50.2%. You need to be at 60% for them to start growing. But uh, we, have, we have started to make some furniture. And I've not seen any, um, any tasks yet that require cities to be X number. So maybe, maybe that's going to be a thing and we should think about it. Only got an immigration office there as well. well. Let's upgrade you. Where else could we fit one? I mean, they're pretty cheap, aren't they? Yes, that's the university. That's it, isn't it? Topeka has... What does Topeka have? Anything? Oh, they don't have anything either. I could have swore we put an immigration office in there, but we didn't. I mean, they're nearly at 100,000, so it doesn't matter. But we'll replace that, I guess, with the university, the University of Topeka. How's our trains doing? We have one on there. Is that the gun train? The gun show train? Uh, there's just loads of dudes hanging off, flexing their muscles. All right, so you're on the way. How many have we delivered? That won't tell us. Uh, we Oh, well, this is the last train, guys. And it's, it's all going to be about Denver and their clothing. So once he's in, we'll get uh, a notification or uh, something telling us that that's been done. Uh, cement factories near Lubbock. Not really bothered. I don't know what we're doing with cement. Maybe we could do something. Lubbock's over this way, isn't it? Yeah. Near Abilene and Amarillo. Come on. You can get there. Well, I don't know what happens to this once he gets there. Do we? Can we just make money off that? It's not the most profitable, is it, of journeys? Because with freight, you want it as close as possible to the origin, unless you're making a city grow. Oh, there we go. Omaha and Kansas are both grown again because uh, the demand is less. And we'll be able to do the same at 50,000. Is it 50,000? Yes, 50,000 there. But we can place as an immigration office in here, can't we? Let's get you... Well, you're boxed in up here successfully. We just messed it up at the logging camp, didn't we? There we go. We've, we've now got an immigration office. That'll help you a little bit. Oh, this is working wonders, isn't it? Our trains are, are in and out quite, uh, quite rapidly. Yeah, I like that. There doesn't seem to be any trains waiting at the entrance now. Nice. Uh, yeah, we should do possibly something with this then. And well, why? Why? <laughs> why? We're not seeing an issue. And we definitely could bring them into two tracks. It would need a little bit of a rework. How's our train? There we go, guys. Camp Raton are getting its final delivery of weapons. I'm not sure what's going to happen over at our weapon back. Tree? I don't know what they're called. Is it, would that be right? I mean, it'll do, won't it? Our rural business making weapons. There we go. 
All right. Armory? No, that's where you store them. Here we go, guys. We're going to get uh, this task complete. Find out what he's got to waffle on about today. Is he going to be gloating? My money's on gloating. Oh, yeah. The smell of gunpowder in the morning. What could be better? Oh, I know. A white flag in the hand of our enemies. I would say close enough. That was fairly gloaty. That's not a word, is it? Right. What happens now? We've done that. By 1870, uh, we're just working on Denver. We've got to get them up to, what was it? Oh, yeah, we've got to get milk there. 50,000. Oh, beautiful. 50,000. Our train taking guns is just doing its thing. Okay, it's staying there for now. Brilliant. And are we making furniture yet? Not yet. We might need another train running down here then. I guess we could double track that at some point. I'm, I'm saving this money because I don't know what's coming next. We could maybe start to upgrade a few things. Oh yeah, there's no supply towering going on here. We may as well see if we can't squeeze it off the side here. Uh, create a block around about there. That should do, shouldn't it? That way our freight trains can supply on the way back into the station. And I guess we could just put another one on the other side. If we've got the room. If I've left the room, it's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. That was a fluke. Beautiful. So Denver. Denver's got some growing to do, but we do need to set up a milk run for them. Well, you know what we could do? We already have a mixed service, don't we? Running from North Platte. First off, we're probably going to need another train on there anyway. So we'll duplicate you. That will be the Inyo. And in your little warehouse, Inyo little warehouse <laughs> dear oh dear uh i won't give up my day job milk and again we're gonna have to cancel milk on this order aren't we yeah because we don't really need it going down from north platte we have it locally i believe i'll have to undo that if that isn't the case is that the case yeah you've got milk right there we could upgrade these couldn't we definitely apples get that upgraded we are making quite a bit from these. And same with that one. We paid 80000 when we bought it. And it's it's now made us 231000 total profit. I don't know where the profit deducts the acquisition cost. Maybe it should do, shouldn't it? Otherwise, it's not profit. But yeah, should we? Shall we increase production here? 336000 It almost paid for its own upgrade there. That's lovely. Oh, you're crossing. I missed it again. It was only a single train anywhere. There was no real action, was there? All right, anything else we could upgrade that's maybe not pulling its weight that would help? Well, we don't own those. That, that would help uh, with the rest of our network. Not really. Maybe the vegetables. I mean, we haven't made our money back on it. We left it there for ages. But sure, let's get uh, a little bit more going out of there. And wasn't it the apples? We were in debt. We actually got out of debt with that one. We owed them quite a bit as well. Or didn't owe them. We just left it there. Didn't make any money off it. And our coal? Our coal is fine. We're just not producing enough chemicals. Are we even... Are we shifting the chemicals? So... Are we bringing in enough sugar... And what was, what was this? Sugar and apples, right? We've got enough apples. We have enough sugar. We're not producing enough liquor. So it's going to be pricey, but we'll get you upgraded. And we'll do the same with our chemicals. Do we have enough coal? I would imagine so, yeah. Supply isn't the issue there. Let's double up on that. It's, it takes 0 0.8 coal per week. And a single coal mine... A single coal mine produces 1.5. There we go. We can almost provide two level two industries with that. Oklahoma City, firstly, doesn't have a, a maintenance depot. But more importantly, they've actually surpassed 10,000 inhabitants rather quickly. I'm impressed by that. When can we build this? 30,000. Look at you go, Oklahoma. Dodge is not in the same boat. 
No. Dodge has been neglected. We've dodged Dodge. Uh, we, we should get them involved somehow, perhaps. I mean, we do take something, don't we? Yeah, Dodge City to Wichita. Do we have a train running up to Dodge from Oklahoma? Hey, we don't. Well, there's, there's a train we could set up. Oklahoma to Dodge. Uh, one train. Yeah, on automatic. Uh, especially since Oklahoma is growing at a rate where we might be able to do something with them. Oklahoma is taking beer to Dodge City because Dodge is probably not getting any grain. No, of course they're not. Well, we want to make it here, don't we? We actually brew it ourselves there. Marvellous. Okay, I think there's a good place to end. No, it's not a good place to end it. I'm wondering if we make the clothing here, will that count? We can send a train over anyway. It counted for London, didn't it? When we made it, uh, we made the alcohol or the liquor in London. It does count each one it makes, but it seems a bit excessive. But then what else would they make? Uh, I mean, yeah, they could take the cloth from here and make their own clothes. Then we've got something on the west side that uh, makes clothing. Yeah, there we go. I'll tell you what, we'll put it in there. Let's get you a fashion industry. I said tailors, didn't I? Yeah, it's not a tailors. 0 0.8, it's going to make 0 0.8 a week, so not a full item of clothing. Maybe it's in tons or something. Pounds, tons. 0 0.8 tons of clothing. That's a lot of clothing. Anyway, guys, I think that's a good place to end it. Denver has grown. We've built them a, a lovely a fashion industry. Well, they should be taking some milk now, shouldn't they? Did I ever set that up? We should set it up. If I did not. What's the other thing they'll be requiring? Vegetables. Yes, we need that now before we go. If they need it now, we should possibly set it up. They do indeed need vegetables. They'll need apples soon as well. Meaning, should we put apples in there? Might need to cancel it going to uh, Wichita. But we'll do that when I come back, if I remember. And vegetables, how are we going to deal with that? Give them a direct train. We have two trains running that, don't we? Well, we don't have one running down that way. That's interesting. Maybe we could get their vegetables from there. Well, let's run one from Hill into Denver because then that's all delivered, isn't it? And we could just wait until four. And then we'll add another one, I guess, heading the other way to uh, North Platte. And we'll ride this train for the end of the episode. Plenty of money in the bank. A bond spare. How much is our bond worth? 21.2 million. That's a lot of money waiting to be spent. All right, guys, we're being loaded up. I thought we'd sit here and load up. And I just realized how steep the track is to Cheyenne. This is the train heading over to Denver with its first train load of vegetables. You can see the other trains on the network in the distance. That's lovely, isn't it? Is that what is that a city over there that we can see in the distance? Would that be Wichita? It's absolutely huge if it is. Or is it trees? It might be trees. Are they square trees? Square grey trees. Green trees. It's misty. Anyway, I digress. Guys, thank you for watching. And until next time, take care.